What's up guys, this is the Roseman and I am back bringing you to the next episode of my Napoleon Total War Let's Play as Great Britain. So the runoff happened in the last part, a, a rebel army laid siege to Paris and we successfully pushed it off. And um, we are now looking cautiously eastwards because there's a quite a large French position here and Napoleon himself may be enticed to advance westwards, westward. And um, we're hoping Sir John Moore could maybe uh, take his attention and then try to massacre him as he tries to cross the river. Um, maybe, if he comes this way. Uh, this army under Bertrand de Lorme is our, the only remaining French rebel army. So we're hoping we, once we do a bit of replenishment and we do a bit more recruiting, we should be able to see them off next time. And we've also got... Actually, let's try and move you. I can't move you at all. Um, oh, no, they're over there. Zones of responsibility converge, so this guy can't do a sneaky attack in Siege to Paris. But yeah, this uh, Black Bob Crawford is here, ready to push onto Brussels, because right now it's currently um, undefended. There will be a weak garrison, and there'll be an immediate counter-attack by the Batavian Republic, so we need to be a bit careful how we do this. And we're sending Wellesley down on a southern route to start to try to threaten either the French rear areas, such as these rivers over the River Rhine. Is this the Rhine? Or is this the Rhine? What's well, an offshoot of it, anyway? Uh, try to start to threaten either rear areas or Strasbourg itself, um, or at least get them to try to commit forces in this direction. Then we also have Sir John Moore moving on, no, Alexander Abercrombie, sorry, moving on to Reno. And thanks to a lot of construction that's been going on in Britain, we have now got a lot of interesting troops being able to be recruited from Scotland, such as the Scots Greys, 15th Hussars, then we've got some of the Connacht Rangers, um, which are some very good units to have. The foot guard, is that unique to them or is that everyone? Foot guards is everyone, but it appears. Yeah, you can also recruit the 15th down here in London. And the Royal Scots Greys down here in London, potentially. Um, but yes, right now we are doing okay. And we've got two universities. Um, quite content to keep chipping away at what's going on. So we're going to research the limited liability company, then hop onto modern rifles. This chap, and they're researching dialectics, will probably go on to do <laughs> random pop to desktop there. Don't quite know why that happened. But once they've searched dialectics, they'll probably move on to another economic upgrade. So probably plate ways. Well, mines is very specific. Steamship propulsion's not so sure I'm so bothered about that. Semaphore lines could be quite handy. Increased line of sight. Uh, we're definitely doing modern rifles. Do we do standardised artillery? Or do we do general staff? Just so I can unlock staff college. Which increases the rate I can build generals and it just effectively unlocks everything. Which is pretty neat. Um, we'll see. See what happens when we get there. So I've done all my spending, done all my recruiting, so the time is to hit and turn and see how the enemy responds. So the French knows that there is a mighty threat to the west. Absolutely do not engage. You are there to watch. Ooh. So Napoleon has headed south directly into the path of Wellesley. Well, let's fight Waterloo a bit earlier, let's, shall we, gents? Okay, so one of these armies is going to head east and smash into Reims. Black Bob Crawford's going to move onto the onto the bridge itself. No further. Um, John Moore's going to head east and hit Reims. Uh, Wellesley is going to engage Napoleon. And Abercrombie is going to lay siege to Torino. Things seem to be going okay. One of your sea trade routes is Ooh. under attack from an enemy fleet. Without your so let's take this spy. And take any goods and income for themselves. Let's run him down to Sh uh, not Stuttgart actually Castle. Ah, so the French have snuck a ship out and we were lamenting I had nothing to do with um, with Nelson so they're just going to very quickly sink these guys because they're going to be frigates frigate and a sloop we shall rule the way. Uh, I'm not going to take the sloop then let's put them into Palma for repairs 
mainly because it's not as much of a naval threat, so I may as well do it. So lots of crewmen in Spain, lots of merchants, got Scots Greys. So the Scots Greys, if I'm right in thinking, I cannot. Well, I can enlist a general. I get Henry Clinton. Or is it because I'm too far away from the capital? Ah, Nelson's column has been built. There she is. Beautiful. But I can't really do much else. Even though there's lots of stuff in theory I can build, I'm limited by my tech. Good. So Paris is fortified. People still hate me. Too much. Do I have anywhere where I can build a religious school? Do I even have a religious school? I've got a members club. Musket manufactory. To be honest, I'll move you up to the bridge. You are going to head... Oh, maybe not head east. Take the high ground to Paris. Next to Paris. I need to be a bit careful in case armies come up. Wellesley is going to engage there. Treat gained hero of the navy. It's pretty darn good. God, he is such a powerful admiral. Okie dokie. Factory in Rouen, Toulouse, which is called Appeals, Paris has got its fort, Madrid I've already checked. Yeah, lots of recruitment in um, these regions. In the regions I suspect they might be attacking under attack in future. It's garrison Toulon. You hit Torino. Ooh, attrition? Oh, because it's winter, isn't it? A unit will suffer attrition. Okay, I'm not going to attack it at the minute. I'm going to fight the Nelson, the um, the Napoleon the fight. Then I will, before I end the turn, I'll set them to attack. So the next turn, or the next part I record, I'll remember to, to do it. So let's take Wellesley, hit Napoleon. Let's engage them. So they have lots of six pounders. So do we, but I have some nines, so we will slightly outrange them. Got a lot of decent infantry, some good cavalry, some heavy cavalry reserve, horse guards, but you also have the man himself. And because Napoleon, because Wellesley is actually more, I think Wellesley is technically the better general in terms of stats at the minute, I deploy first. Oh, but it looks like our forces, our armies could be separated this river. Depending on how deep it is. So there's a bridge there. So there's a bit of an outcrop there. I'm not sure if that made something there, potentially. Hmm. I don't know, it's just a road. So Napoleon's going to deploy up there. So my artillery probably wants to be. Where do I want? So because I'm attacking, I think they might hunker down. So what I'd like is to get... Let's get two batteries through this gap in the trees and deploy. Hopefully. Another two batteries here. Just to get them through this wood. Maybe deploy them here. Experimental howitzer can follow up the centre. So then let's pick some... Infantry to form my centre. Because they will not run away easily. Not with Napoleon in, in charge. Got these guys to protect my flanks. My strongest on the left flank, so I'm going to want to push it. But I'm probably going to want to put... 
keep my cavalry somewhere towards the middle for now. My light infantry can get ready to skirmish up the centre. The only saving grace is that we know. Okay, that's my centre. Ah, no, no, we have to redeploy our artillery. So you are no good there. <laughs> Gotta beware the cavalry. the bulk of their cavalry on the left. I put my hussars over there. My howitzers can set up in the town. Skirmishers just move up. Fire will off. Wellesley himself can set up in the town. So there he is. There's your man. Unlike the Wellesley in Waterloo, I have no problem with aiming my artillery at you. So I think I might just speed up time a little bit. Because my guys are going to get shot at soon. Probably my artillery, well my artillery will get shot at first as it's on the move. Hopefully because my infantry may be f technically first in range, they might get the first shot. Nope. They, they are standing still. Okay, now they're getting ready. So this artillery particularly needs to get needs to be ready. It looks like... No, they've just redeployed. Good. I was thought they were actually driving an attack for a second. Let's move my cavalry a bit further out. Yep, they're going for my infantry. Unlucky for them, but good for my guns. And these guys are going to aim for their artillery and be on barrage. So let's do some manual targeting. Pummeling my centre. So keep you. I'm going to spend a lot of barrages on attacking their guns. Wait there. So they're abandoning their position on the left. Keep your guns firing, men. Yeah, I'm doing a lot of damage. So then lob shells over my men. So they are. So I may have to do some of this. I 
There we go, lobbing shells in from a different angle. are in position. Let's run them because it looks like they might be coming to play. Ooh, we need to... so let's unlimber my experimental howitzer. This light foot can now plug this gap. Bring Wellesley into the mix. So lots of men will be dying here as secondary casualties. So where is Napoleon? Oh, he's back here. So they're throwing their cavalry into the mix. One of the riderless horses is on the move. So they're now looking much weaker on this flank than they were. Oh, these men are going into the cauldron. French hussars falling by the dozen. This light horse are moving in with their very fetching little jackets. Center, where's my experimental howard? So you start plucking at some of the infantry. You guys keep barraging their artillery line. Let's get these guys out of square, back in line, start firing. Was Napoleon. Napoleon's in the centre. He's in the thick of it. Are you engaging? King's German Legion are not engaging, which isn't what I wanted. I want them to both be able to fire at the same targets. Once these guys have annihilated this militia unit, which should fall soon. Starting to push this flank. Retarget my howitzer because they're getting a bit close to my line now. He got killed by a. Oh, my general! Oh, I didn't mean you to run into the general. 
Okay, you go on to the cavalry, so let's get these guys to start hitting some of their some of their infantry. So yeah. Gunners and man your guns. Yes, you should be concerned. There's a whole load of cavalry coming to kill you. Oh, come on, click, click, click. Well, you want to do something like this. You guys want to do something like this. Cavalry is going to mop up. It's going to mop up the guns. Oh, you go for the light horse, the fortieth light horse. Need to come up here and start to threaten that flank. It's ugly as sin. Let's hold fire of my howitzer. You go after the fuse laser of the line. Yep, they have killed some of those men. But they have charged the French. I need to be very careful what I do now so I don't end up killing my own guys with my own artillery in a crossfire. Bonaparte's mighty army being shot to pieces by the scum of the earth. No, no, no. Let's get Boney involved. Let's turn off all their artillery fire. Unfortunately, enemy general are wounded. <sighs> it's very frustrating when they do that. It's like, no, I want to kill him. Oh, I might just run them into him. Kill my own wells late. Uh, let's move them in and let's turn fire well off. Turn my artillery off. You guys keep running. Go on, Wellesley.
let's... I can't even be you guys up because your horses run away. Make ready. Oh, poor, poor dears. Just get absolutely shot to bits. Absolutely continue. And let's triple speed it. Let's just let the AI have at it. Although, how many have you got left to kill? One there. And there's the last guy. The 19th Regiment of Foot. Decimated. And then, let's probably go get... I'll send you off to the 131st. Such... Such unfortunate luck for the French that their armies have just been knocked back time and time again. Although this absolutely did not happen in real life. It took us a hell of a long time to actually... Um, to actually have competent, competent leadership, competent tactics. And multiple attempts to actually be... To do, this, to do this well against the French. And this unit's about to flee. Close? Close? How close can you get? Turn my artillery off. Not have them involved. Didn't need them. BS 1200 lost. They lost their entire force. Let's finish them off. The entire French stack under the command of Bonaparte himself has fallen. So go secure this high ground to the north. Excellent. That's another great battle for Wellesley. Did he get anything for that? Conquering hero. Plus two percent army campaign movement range. Oh, Wellesley, are the retainers assistant? You're, you're just so great. Well, that's my spy. Okay, let's also fight the assault on Torino, so my guys have to weather the storm or to weather winter, because right now they are very exposed. So I'm not sure how much use my artillery is going to have. So I'm probably going to advance them all up in one big line to fire over the line of my men. Let's get a strong line of fusiliers. Then probably one big anvil on the flank. General and general staff just... Well, the general staff and cavalry just... Peace out. So these are six. Yeah, these are all six pounders. This looks like a nice position. Move up my general staff and his cavalry, and then let's triple speed it. This is what happens, chaps. We want your billets. The models in this game do look very good. See, if I could just get the graphics of Napoleon and the gameplay of Napoleon, really, into the campaign of campaign scale of an empire game, that would be perfect. Yeah, it's the cavalry have taken the lead. Some stragglers. Let's just let let the game tick on. See, see, I'm I'm kind of stuck back in the mentality of that last battle because I'm thinking, why, 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 why does the game have to have it so that you can't actually kill Napoleon? Whoa, okay.
Oh, it's damn nice of them to march up into my musket range. It's very, very cold. Apart from these guys, these guys aren't going to march in, but I want you as well. Sir, sir, our general is under attack. There we go, the first volleys of the disciplined British fire. Poor. Poor sods. You will make a valiant effort, I, I, I guarantee it. Peculiar way to throw away the general. Just a bit forward. Garrison militia. Unlimber. It's going to be bloody. This is. We have killed their general, sir. Now they must Sure, we did. Oh, he shot him when he ran away. I've selected you, haven't I? Yes, I have. But now the artillery's involved. Let's let these guys fire into the retreating army, into this retreating unit, just to make sure they lose as many men and as much morale as possible. Ah, see, so they have come. See, those guys have come back. Straighten the line out. Let's get rid of this. Let's get rid of this dog leg. Yeah, let's end two, just to make sure. Plenty of men to spare. Is the artillery? Pounds their position. It's not really a lot they can do about it. Poor militia. So these are mostly to be drawn from Franco Italian families. Doesn't matter about capturing any retreating troops. To be honest, I might just run and charge these guys in. We know that the French can't march on us without having to engage us immediately, because always they'll be suffering from the same attrition as we are. See, even the damn armed citizenry looks just so suave. Although it shouldn't, really. I guess you'd almost, you could almost say these were like... National Guard almost? Not right, quite militia, but they may be former servicemen or... You know, some sort of history. God, the last few fragments of resistance. I mean, I am very much using a hammer to smash open a wall that, but.
But why not? If you've got a hammer, if you've got a hammer and you can safely use the hammer, why not use it to smash open a walnut? It's not a very efficient deployment of these guys, but I just need to find a gap. These men that are becoming veterans campaigning across the continent of Europe. Just surrender, regiment of foot. Got still a unit remaining. Then let's triple speed this because they may not even make it to engage our lines. Oh, see, so they, are they going to do the, the frustrating thing? And is the AI going to kind of go, ah? Don't try and engage their main line. Go for these guys that are on the fringe. I mean, all you're doing is slowing down... Slowing down your own inevitable demise. So I have no problem triple speeding this because this one's just a bit more of a... a bit more of a frustration rather than an actual battle now. <laughs> Thought we had them on the ropes, but it turns out lots of them have decided to come back. Route, route, route. Last unit's form square in a solemn show of defiance. He's going to get shot to pieces and break. Phew! End battle with a heroic victory for Alexander Abercrombie. There is a, there is a reasonable French garrison in Milan. Let us loot. So I am interested in liberating areas like Brussels and Amsterdam to make, you know, Holland and Belgium. Well, actually, well, no, even then, I need to I need to capture them. I need to take them. If I was just playing, like, a, a campaign with about 20 or 30 regions, then I would, but this is a long campaign. I need to capture 60. So I need to start. I don't know. There's a, there's a lot of regions to go around. I don't know, 60 might be ultimately over here, like if I push just straight from the west. Um, but yes, we have secured Torino. I will expose us up to a bit of raiding. But that's okay. Let's build some infrastructure. Everyone's happy, even though we've broken your buildings. Milan is under watch. Oh, the Russians have taken Switzerland. How did they get in there? Did they... Hmm. I'm going to be engaging the Prussians fast, sooner than I desired, so probably will want as much firepower as I can muster. King's German Legionary Dragoons, that's most Scots Greys. Um, but yes, looking at the timer, I've overran slightly, so I think we're going to put a cut here. So thanks for watching, guys. Hope you've enjoyed, and we'll see you next time for the continued adventures of Great Britain.